Where'd your buffaloes here? Hello everyone, my name is Nobohat Subhasaktidikun, but you can just call me Bike. Today, I will tell you about Talenoi, a part of the wetlands. But first, you need to know what a wetland is. Wetlands is an area of forest where it is like flooded by water for either permanently or seasonally. Wetlands are also one of the most biologically diverse in the whole world. Talenoi, also known as Talenoi Water Bird Park, is a freshwater lake located in Patalum, the southern part of Thailand. It is also the country's most important wetland areas and is designated as a Ramsar site. During certain times of the year, Palenoi becomes a popular destination for migratory birds. The lake's marshy wetlands provide abundant food sources, shelter, and breeding grounds for these visitors. Palena is home to over 187 species of native and migratory birds, which these birds flew thousands of kilometers from their breeding grounds to reach the warmer climate of Palena and its surroundings. The water buffaloes are very ordinary, but they have adjusted themselves very well. During the flood season, when the grass here is flooded, these water buffaloes just simply dive down and graze. That's how they survive in the wetland areas. Also, when the water buffaloes just like walk all around to find food, their footprints made some tracks. Which tracks are, you may know that it is deeper than the other part of the soils. And when summer comes, then the water is like dried all out, the fish will have some place to survive. There's little water left, so the fish will just like can stay in the track of the buffaloes. This is the dependency within animals. The Talenoi wetland buffalo pasture agrow ecosystem is a farming system where humans and buffaloes have interacted for a long time. Therefore, it has shaped the landscape, the biodiversity, and also the culture of the people in the area. Therefore, it's been designated as the GIAS in 2022, which stands for Globally Important Agricultural Heritage Systems. And here's how to do the Globe Observer app land cover protocol. When you find a page like this, click to the land cover protocol. Please note to read everything before clicking the next button. When you find a page like this, go to the new land cover observation and enter the local date and time of the observation. Then, paste in your latitude and longitude of the area. There are no snow and ice in the conditions. There is standing water. It is also muddy, but the ground is not dry. There are leaves on the trees, and it is not raining or snowing. Please take pictures of the up and down by uh, aligning the circles up and down. After that, take pictures of the north, east, south, and west by rotating your camera horizontally and clicking your screen to take a picture. If you have any additional information about the location, feel free to type it into the box.
Click continue to analyze the land cover by identifying the land cover by choosing. After that, select the percentages of the land cover. Click send all land cover data now. Now we'll have to wait. Right now, the data has been sent successfully to the Globe office. And that's all for today. If you like the video, feel free to leave a like and subscribe button to our channel. That will help us a lot. Anyway, see you next time. Bye.